Here's Aaron in our living room putting up some um, curtain rods. Uh, this is a few weeks back when we first moved in. I just wanted to show you guys my team putting up these curtain rods. He is so good at putting these rods up. I had him to put up all the curtain rods throughout the house, you know, and he did an excellent job, I must say so. So he doesn't see me filming him, but <laughs> if he did, he'd be like, Mom, don't do that. Well, I'm in this furniture store because I wanted to look for a desk for my office. And I'm showing you guys a little bit of what's in here. I'm not able to show much because guess what? I was asked to stop filming. So, you know, they have the right to ask me to stop filming. But however, it that turned me off. And I thought to myself, and I even told the lady, I said, hey, I'm a YouTuber and I could actually get you guys some sales you never know but their policy was that or is that there's no filming so I said okay well to myself it's time to leave um, I, you know they don't get a sale from me <laughs> uh, you know you have the right to ask me to stop filming but that you know I just have to go with the flow but I'm no longer interested in seeing what else you have in the store so Boy, if I tell you, if I could get that, I would, but not here. So anyway, I just wanted to share a little bit of this uh, furniture place, but I'm not able to share much. So we are out of here. Okay, I'm sitting here in the imaging center here. I'm about to get me a mammogram, my yearly mammogram. So I'm just showing you my little rings that I got for the breast cancer awareness. Because you know October is Breast Cancer Awareness. So I'm just showing you my bracelets that I've always had. And I like to wear them each and every day. Especially when I go out somewhere. Um, so I'm doing a voiceover because I didn't want to. I didn't feel comfortable talking. And there's few people around me. So I'm just sitting here and uh, waiting for them to call me. And just trying to relax. And um, I hope you guys are having a great day today. I do plan on going to the store. I'll probably stop by Dollar Tree to see what they have new. Maybe look at some Christmas items that they have. I might do a Dollar Tree haul if I do pick up anything. I'll share it with you. So just wanted to say hey, hey, hey. And uh, I'll see you guys very soon after my mammogram appointment. And this is how it looks. Not too many people in here, but there's a few people over on the other side. And there's a red marking tape, you know, where you have to stay six feet apart, like everybody should be doing. And in a few minutes, there's going to be a nurse coming and she's going to wipe down all the chairs. But you'll see her in a second. But she's she wipes down the handles. There she is. She wipes down the handles. But I think she should wipe down the seat part and the back part. I know if that were me, that's what I would do. And I would be wearing a glove. <laughs> I guess she doesn't want to wear gloves. But, you know, I guess to each his own. But that's what I would be doing. I'm going to wear me a glove if I'm wiping down somebody's germy self, you know. <laughs> and that's the imaging uh, name, you know, sign for the women.
you guys can hear me I'm in my car as you can see and I have my air condition running I'm gonna try to turn it down so you don't hear you know all the air blowing out but this is Friday and I'm having a blessed day in spite of all that I have gone through uh, first of all um, I don't know if you can see my pink shirt on and I showed you guys earlier what I had on but I had my mammogram done so I'm expecting a good report from the doctor as always but those of you who do not know I am a breast cancer survivor of 11 years so I'm just really happy yay yay for me thank God but anyway I stopped in Dollar Tree as you guys know and uh, I was just showing you just whatever I could find that was new um, the Christmas things that they had and uh, I was in, in there to find some pink things because uh, I'm going to be doing a tablescape for you guys, you know, in the near upcoming future. So let me just show you what I have. Do this little haul right now. First thing I got are some new and pretty flowers that they had. Um, this is the bunch here. I've got a few purples, as you can see. I think this is so pretty and this is called Hi Hi 8 I can't pronounce it never mind <laughs> but this is so pretty I love that and I have a different purple flower as well and I think this is looks like lilac or something not lilac but tulips let me see no this is called crocus believe it or not this is crocus crocus is pretty and just some different shades of pink flowers here so pretty so we won't go into all you know the names of those and um, I picked up two of these little candle holders I got it because it's pretty and it's pink so I'll just show you one tea light holders the lighting's probably off, so I don't know. Put the tea light. You can put a candle up here or put the tea light in here. Or you can decorate it and use it, you know, any way you want. But I have two of those. And I like the little the little holes in there. Like little diamond cut shape. So I got two of those. And then you guys I picked up all three of those um leaf plates that they had and they're gold and they're so pretty look at that isn't that beautiful so I got three of them so and that was the only three that they had that I saw so I got it so I am so happy so happy and excuse my appearance I don't have any makeup on and of course I wouldn't have any lipstick on because I had my mask on you know at the imaging place for my mammogram so I wouldn't be having lipstick on but I should have put some on at least for the camera but anyway then I picked up two AA batteries and I'm gonna give this to Aaron because he's always going through our <laughs> AA batteries you guys have any AA batteries I'm like why don't you go buy yourself some so that's for him and then I picked up this little pretty blue um, whatever you want to call this you can put a candle in it but I just thought it was so pretty and kind of like a frosty look so I just got one of those put a tea light in there and I just randomly grabbed a pack of the um, leaves napkins a pack of napkins I may use it and I may not then Oh, that's the other pink thing. It's kind of hard to do a hole in the car, and I didn't take out everything and lay it out. But anyway, I got two of these little ribbons, bowl ribbons, whatever you want to call them. Two of those. I think those are cute. I like it because it has the different colors, pink, white, dark pink, and purple. Then I got a pack of eight uh, gift what is that it says gift sacks I call them bags same thing just eight of those so one pack 
Now these, I saw these last time I was in Dollar Tree and I never picked them up and I saw them again and I said, okay, you're coming home with me. These cute little, I don't know what you call them, but they're just so adorable. I don't know if you can see it. The lighting may be off, you guys, but it has a little pink nose here and little eyelashes on the other side. You may be able to see them, but I can't really see it when I look at the camera right here. So I hope you guys can see it not sorry about that and then I picked up I don't know if I'm gonna use this on my table I may but I love the color of these pink little plate party plates how cute is that just, the pink is just so breast cancer color you know like my sweater that I'm wearing so I have an idea for this stuff so we'll see and last but not least I picked up two rectangular um, plastic table um, tablecloths for the table and that's all that I picked up I hope you guys are having a good day and um, are staying safe everybody's staying safe I'm staying safe the best way I can and um, that's it but anyway, I just wanted to really quickly, I'm not going to spend a lot of time with this. Um, I'm just going to encourage every lady, if you're between the right age, and you, you would know if you're between the ages that you can get a mammogram. Okay, um, 2009, I'm just going to briefly say this. 2009, I was diagnosed with um, stage 1 breast cancer, and thank God um, I survived, and it's been 11 years, so every year I get my mammogram, so I want to encourage you guys, go get your mammogram, if you are, you know, just talk with your physician first, because, you know, you may be at the age where you're too young to get it, and maybe you're not, so talk with your doctor, but if you are, I'm just encouraging you guys to please get your mammogram it saves lives it really does okay and I'm just so thankful to be alive and um, it's 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 a blessing it really is it's a blessing to be alive and um, so go ahead and get that mammogram it may feel a little uncomfortable you know especially if you get it for the first time but it's better to feel a little uncomfortable than to to feel a lot uncomfortable when they give you a big diagnosis right okay so I'm just encouraging you guys get your mammogram and I'm also guys I forgot to share with you I uh, was given this little cute pretty box from the imaging place where I got my mammogram and I've never opened it up so um, give me a moment I'm gonna let you see what's in here this is my first time seeing oh is this a mug Ooh, no what is this Oh, how cute is this? This is like a mug. Wait a second. How cute is that? This is so cute. It's a little mug, coffee cup with the little spoon. I like this. This is so adorable. And it says strength. Wait a minute. Strength is, is, wait a minute. Kind of hard to see. Strength is a beauty I can't even read it, guys, because I look. I'm looking at the camera as well. So, strength, something, beauty, uh, shade of pink. But this is so adorable. How cute is that? And this is the little card that came with the mug. It says eco-friendly wheat fiber mugs. I guess the mug is made out of wheat fiber, <laughs> which is very strange. So I guess that's the type of mug that it is. And it says, "What is a wheat fiber mug?" Wheat fiber mugs cut down on the consumption of plastic mugs and disposable paper coffee cups. They're made of the plant-based leftovers from agricultural processes, not chemicals or petroleum like other reusable mugs, which makes them much better for the environment. But I just want to share that with you guys. I'm on my way home so I can um, unwind and de-stress from that uh, mammogram and um, I'm going to catch you guys later I want to thank you so much for watching this if you guys want to see a particular video or me do something 
you know that you have not seen or that you know I can do um, leave me a comment down below and let me know what kinds of videos you guys would like to see me do okay I don't say that much to you guys but I need to think of it so I'm thinking of it now so if you have if you have any ideas just let me know down in the comment section okay I love you guys take care be blessed I'll see you guys in my next video bye